It's good to be with you. Welcome to class outside. Today, we are going to learn how to render multiple image sequences all at once in Blender. For this, we will need more than one folder containing an image sequence. We will also need the batch renderer add-on available on GitHub, linked in the description. The first step is to make sure all of the image sequence folders we want to render are in the same location on your computer. Once these folders are in the same parent folder, we can prepare the add-on. Visit the GitHub link below and download the Blender add-on. Then extract the zip file. Now open Blender and enter a new video editing instance. Go to Edit, Preferences, and select the Add-ons tab. Click Install and navigate to the folder we just downloaded. and select the batch renderer file. Once installed, confirm that the add-on is set to active with a check mark. Now, in Blender, go to the file browser view and navigate to the folder that contains your image sequence folders. Hold down the control key and select the folders you want to render. Once all folders are selected, right click and select start batch renderer. Here, you will see a list of selected folders. Below will be an option to select the desired frame rate of the output. Once satisfied, you can start the batch renderer process. The batch renderer will configure the timeline to the correct beginning and end frames, and it will output the rendered video to the same folder where your image sequence folders may be found. The process can take some time while Blender is working. You can monitor what has been completed so far in the file explorer. Once completed, all rendered videos should be available. Look at that. Together, we have rendered multiple videos in sequence with the batch renderer. Please let me know down in the comments what you thought of this video. Have a great day and thank you for attending Class Outside.